The universe is a complicated system designed expressly to help humanity understand and reach their full spiritual potential. Within this system, there are 12 unique universal laws that, when learned, have the ability to help us understand our divinity and reach a higher level of consciousness. Few people have been exposed to these laws and even fewer have mastered them. To yet only a few yogis and mystics have intrinsically grasped and used these laws. But, as a new age dawns, so does the chance for all humanity to learn and apply these laws in our daily lives. Many of us have never heard of these commandments. Most of us were never taught about them in school, and many of our forefathers were not exposed to these hallowed truths. It's no surprise that many people have suffered in recent years with emotions of helplessness and lack of empowerment. Most people are unaware that there are additional laws of the universe that operate in tandem with one another. To fully comprehend any aspect of these principles, one must apply and utilize all 12. With this in mind, let us investigate these 12 universal laws, and together we shall master the 12 universal laws. 1. The Law of Attraction Let's go on to this law, which is well known. It was made popular by the best-selling book, The Secret. This concept was first introduced in Wallace D. Wattles' 1910 book, The Science of Getting Rich. Once again, our faith or belief is what drives our intentions. What we think and feel deep within ourselves is reflected in our physical reality. I am sure you have heard that what we think determines what we become. In truth, our beliefs shape who we become. Believe you have a bountiful life and so it will be. No matter how many times you say, I have an abundant life, if you don't believe it deep down in your spirit, it will not manifest in your physical world. 2. The Law of Correspondence This law has a direct relationship to the law of universal oneness. Patterns repeat throughout the universe, with large patterns repeating on smaller patterns. The goal is to notice these patterns in our own lives, so that we can take action to either maintain positive patterns or change patterns that are no longer serving us. 3. The Law of Universal Oneness the first illusion that humanity believed setting the stage for most of the world's pain and anguish was that we are all separate. This tremendous illusion has driven humanity away from our genuine spiritual essence and the source. Everything in the universe is related. Every human being, every living animal, every tree, rock, and even the grass we walk on is related to the source that creates this amazing matrix known as the universe. As a result, every decision we make, every action we do, and every idea we have has an impact on the matrix. This may appear to be a lot of responsibility, but when we live our lives with an awareness of interconnectedness, we empower ourselves to live our most divine lives. Knowing that we are all related allows us to appreciate the power of empathy, which has the potential to alter the world. Through heart-centered living, we may become the change we seek. We become the path. Four the law of cause and effect. This law is commonly known as the law of karma. Whatever you send out into the world will come back to you. This is a necessary law since it shows us how our actions influence others. Whatever we do to another person, whether it is a beautiful gesture or one that causes sorrow, it will eventually come back to us. This law is directly related to the law of universal oneness. We are all connected, so everything we do to others is also done to ourselves. 5. The Law of Vibration Everything in the universe vibrates at a subatomic level. Everything in the universe has its own vibration and is constantly in motion and full of energy. At the particle level, everything vibrates. Therefore, high vibrating particles attract other high vibrating particles whereas lower vibrating particles attract lower vibrating particles. This is where the saying, like attracts like, originated. We literally are the vibrations we create. This is how we attract our tribe of kindred souls. Your vibe attracts your tribe. Your buddies will give you a decent idea of what your vibratory frequency is. To change anything in your life, merely shift your frequency, which will attract a new vibration. 6. The Law of Polarity Everything in this universe has its inverse. Happiness must coexist with sadness, hot must coexist with cold, up must coexist with down, 
and day must coexist with night. Without one, we would be unable to distinguish between them. Each proverbial side of the coin is required to recall that we are one with the universe. We must experience contrasts in order to verify our decisions on this plane. Every opposite has worth as a teaching tool that allows us to create the life we want. If the universe chose for us, we would lose our free will, and it is via free will that we travel on a journey to recall how we are all related. We are given the option of loving or hating in order to recognize the truth of the first universal law, the law of universal oneness. 7. The Law of Inspired Action This is a very crucial law that is often overlooked, preventing the manifestation of the law of attraction. To manifest our objectives, we must take action to make them a reality in our physical environment. Your behaviors must be consistent with your objectives, and when they are, the prospect of quick manifestation exists. In summary, we must take action to make our dreams come true. They will not appear on our doorstep without some effort on our part. We must take the initial steep and the universe will respond to our actions. We take a steep and the universe replies. This is performing the two-step with the university. We stand still. And so does the universe. We realize our dreams by taking inspired action. Fate the law of relativity. This law argues that everything in the universe is neutral when viewed in isolation and that it is only when we assign meaning to anything that we see it reflected in our reality. There is no good or bad. It is merely our perception that assigns those names. The universe is a blank canvas that reflects our thoughts and beliefs back at us. Our minds are like movie projectors and our thoughts are the film that is fed through them. Whatever we think is projected onto the universe's blank canvas and returned to us as a movie of our lives. If your thoughts are negative and full with struggle like a horror movie, the universe will reflect them on its blank screen. If you have ideas of love, compassion and kindness, this is the movie that will reflect them back to you. Allow the movie of your life to be one that you would be happy to exhibit to the world. Make it a masterpiece. Sassine, the law of compensation. This law is similar in that it asserts that whatever you put out into the world will come back to you, but the law of compensation takes a step further by stating that whatever is in your heart will be returned to you. Words are powerful, but our sentiments and belief structures are what give us the ability to bring our thoughts into being. Because the universe is made up of energy, this law ensures that whatever energy we have will be compensated for with similar energy. For example, if you do a kind deed for someone while harboring animosity or acting negatively, the resentment and wrath will be returned. If you do these things with love in your heart, you will receive love in return. 10. The Law of Perpetual Transmutation of Energy this law demonstrates that the universe is always changing. Change is the only constant. The most beautiful aspect of this law is the awareness that no matter where you are in your life, you have the power and talent to transform it into the life you desire. 11. Uh, the Law of Gender Everything in this universe is made up of masculine and female energy, which the Chinese refer to as yin and yang. Many people believe that they are competing forces, whereas in fact, they are complementary and cannot exist without one another. Yogis refer to the highest form of yoga as the union of male and female energy. A divine union is formed, resulting in a pair greater than the sum of its parts. We observe this in power couples who are stronger together than they would be alone. When compatible energies come together, the combination has the capacity to change the world. 12. The Law of Rhythm Everything is cyclical and rhythmic. Life and death are inextricably intertwined. Fall precedes winter, which leads to spring and then summer. The moon waxes and wanes, and we experience many seasons in our own lives. We may be married for years and suddenly find ourselves single, or we may have lived a life of wealth only to find ourselves in a state of scarcity. These are the natural cycles of the universe. A once magnificent rose gradually withers and wilts, returning to dust. Understanding and appreciating these cycles enables us to become unattached to any single stage of life. The tides surge and then retreat, and both are fine. It is only when we choose one state over another that we bring dissatisfaction into our life. The yogi views each stage as simply that, a stage. 
When we recognize that everything changes, we may find calm when it does.